So the way this, the, our plant is structured here is, is we have 100,000 square feet and the idea is to have a flow of material that's trying to work its way from the back of the plant through here, through the shipping area and then out to, to the projects. We're in the area where we're taking these aluminum extrusions. They've already been finished and now they're being uh, cut and they're also punched, which means some of the holes that we're using to join the corners with fasteners, with screws, those punches are part of the process working towards the actual final uh, assembly of the frames. Okay, we have the aluminum extrusions. Now they're in this area where we're assembling everything. As you can see, uh, part of the assembly process is these grids. Uh, and these grids uh, are joined with uh, spring pins or metal, metal pins at the intersections of the grids and also as these grids are then fitted into the frame of the window or the sash of the, of the window if it's an operable unit. Basically this is assembling these spacer frames. So this is getting the corner keys in place in the corners, producing some holes for gas filling. And then this machine here, he's actually extruding the primary seal so it creates a, a, a first line of defense for moisture getting in between the two panes of uh, glass. And the glass is going to come from the cutting area. It's going to go through a glass washer into this uh, clean room here where the uh, unit is then assembled. The two pieces of glass are put together with a frame and then it's run through a press and then on the other side we will seal the perimeter to complete the insulated glass unit. Okay, here we have the insulated glass unit. We're doing our gas filling process. As you will see here, we have these, these tubes that's filling the insulated glass with argon gas, and the glass will, will have a, a fill that will remain there for the life of the unit. So over here, we have a frame. These frames are all fully fabricated now. They're getting these frames prepared to put the glazing material in. As you can see, you have a glazing tape, which is where the, the insulated glass is gonna be dropped into place. Uh, and this creates a very good, con consistent and continuous seal around the entire perimeter. The glass will drop in, it'll create a very good seal around that entire piece of glass. 